Welcome, welcome back at any help at C square in this example. We have a circle and we notice R A and T A, uh, which are these two segments, are tangent to circle O. Uh, we need to find the measure of arc RT. We need to find out how much, how many degrees uh, measure that arc RT. And the first thing I would like you to take a look is this statement down here, this theorem. If we have a tangent to a circle, that tangent is perpendicular to the radius. So, in other words, this OR is perpendicular on RA or OT is perpendicular on TA. Why? Because these two segments are tangent to the circle uh, O's. So, that's my first statement I'm going to write here. OR perpendicular on RA and OT is perpendicular on TA. And these two statements will tell me that the measure of angle R is 90 degrees and the measure of angle T is also 90 degrees. And now we can go in the uh, quadrilateral ORAT. And we can write that the sum of the interior angle of this quadrilateral is 360 degrees. So we're going to have the measure of angle O plus the measure of angle R plus the measure of angle A plus the measure of angle T uh, is nothing else than 360 degrees. And measure of angle O is the one we need to find out. I'm going to call it X to make this problem more algebraically. Angle R is 90 degrees. Angle A, 40 degrees. And angle T is also 90 degrees. And that will be equals of 360. We just need to combine the three numbers here. 90 plus 90 plus 140. And that will be... Uh, 180 plus 40, 220 degrees. And the last thing, subtract 220 from 360. And we get an X of 140 degrees. So that X is nothing else than the measure of angle O. And now if we take a look, angle O, this angle is a central angle, and this arc is the intercept arc for this angle, and the measure of angle O will be equal to the measure of arc RT. So the measure of, of arc RT will be nothing else than uh, 100 and 40 degrees. If you enjoyed this video clip, don't forget to click the like button and come back on C-square for more help. Thank you.